y'all. Tammy here with Happy Art Creations. Hey, I'm so glad to be with you, and I'm so glad you chose to do today with me. To oh man, there went my glove. To do today with me. Um, anyhow, I'm gonna do something different. Now I'm I'm still working on you know the uh, drizzle and what is it? Drizzle, drizzle, swipe, wreck, and spin. And my gloves don't want to come on because I was out with the dogs and my hands were a little sweaty when I had my gloves on with the puppies. Yeah, I did. Anyhow, so while I'm working on getting my gloves on, so I get for these mediums too. They're kind of big. The fingertips blow up and they're long for my fingers. Let me put it that way. See how they wrinkle? Sometimes that happens when you're messing with them. But now my hands are a little sweaty and they don't want to move. Anyhow, I'm going to do that same technique. Can you see this? I have taped around the edges like it would be framed. And I put it on really tight and kind of did this. And I've protected my base and I made sure. But I kind of want to see after it dries what it looks like. Like, I don't know. I'm just doing it because. All right, I'm going to use my ocean colors. But I'm gonna. I added a um, a Prussian blue. See that? I want it a little bit darker than the phalo. Let me show you the difference. Phalo. See the difference? It's definitely Prussian blue. Always dries um, darker. I'm still gonna use the black base. I've decided that's what I want to do right now. Okay. So I've got my Prussian blue by Golden. Ooh, I forgot to take this off. Um, and I have my Sapphire by Naked Fusion Pigments, Mica Pigments. Oh, I just love that thing. Then I've got my Cobalt, Golden Cobalt Turquoise. Say that five times fast. You can. This is Naked Fusion. This is their um, Green Apple. It didn't show up a whole lot last time in it, and I'm kind of glad, but I might add a little bit more. Um... And guys, this was Arteza. I said maybe golden, but it's Arteza Prussian Blue. Okay. Made me think when I'm fixing to show you this next one. The next one is the Pearl uh, Arteza Pearl Turquoise. Woo! And it is like beautiful. And then the wonderful Goldens uh, Phalo Blue. And I'm still using the. Um, where's my one thing? My. Um, Naked Fusion Ghost Blue. It's kind of like an interference or, you know, like that. It goes on like this and it and it kind of looks this creamy color, but when it dries, it only dries with that blue flashy hue to it, okay? So really, that's all I'm going to do. Oh, and my 24 karat gold. My bottle is like awful, but it's, it's Deco Art 24 karat gold. Now, I'm fixing to add this on, okay? Really, I've got my sides covered too because I'm probably just going to paint them white. So, ooh, there we go. Messy times happens. All right, and I have my um, Golden's Oxide Black for my um, cell enhancer. Um, I have that. I'm probably using too much of this paint, but you know, I just kind of feel like I don't know. I don't know any better, right? yet. And I'm really, so I'm just going to give it a little spin. There we go. And kind of get that extra off. I'm going to go ahead and stop it with this for right now. Okay. Um, put my lid on my uh, color plays. Okay. Again, I'll show you what I use. I just get these little paint cards just like this and I cut them up into smaller pieces, whatever. I've got all different sizes, okay? This is a larger canvas, so I'm not quite sure what I'm going to use yet. There are little bubbles, and y'all, if you don't get these bubbles ahead of time, the big ones, that when they pop, they'll pop with white paint coming up. So you'll have these little white dots in your paint and you're going, what the hay bird happened here? And that's what happened, okay? So, anyhow, y'all ready to start? I'm fixing to do my drizzling. Where do I want to start? I think I'm going to do this gold. Just said yes, it, it followed in just a sec. It follows the boing boing. It starts being elastic. There you go. All right, here we go. 
Now, normally on this, you would put it all the way out, but remember, I have tape underneath there. Okay, so I really don't have to. This might be a pretty swipe. I may make that into a swipe one day. Okay, now I'm going to put my sapphire because you know. Blingy, 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 bling. And this is just the drizzle. This is just all there is to it. And I might have done a little bit much right there, but. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Can you have too much bling? Probably. Here's the cobalt turquoise. Beautiful texture. Mm. And it dries so pretty. Now my other one's not dry that I did the other day, or yeah, earlier today, not the other day, earlier today. It's not dry yet. So I'm not going to mess with it, y'all. I'm going to leave it alone. Okay. The next one's that apple green, the um, Naked Fusion. I am going to put a little bit more in this, okay? Although I'm doing an oceany colors, this isn't necessarily oceany, but I still adore this color. I don't like to mix it with orange, even though it's pretty, because it does something goofy. All right, my Arteza Pearl Turquoise, and it is pearl. And that is really pretty underneath. All right, I did put my dark underneath. And here is my phalo, which I think is gorgeous. Here comes the boing. Hang on. Gonna make me a fibber. There it goes, boing. Anyhow, it's got the elasticity that's needed for this particular um, ditty here. Okay. I'm gonna add a little bit more of this. little bit more of the cobalt. Afraid to put more sapphire. I feel like I need something else in it. Maybe that on top. Oh my gold. Oh my gosh. And my blue. Ghost blue. See it kind of goes on looking white. And it doesn't, you know, have to be. And my beautiful gold, 24 karat gold. And I've got this to be the most perfect texture. And my gold did show up last time. Very, very nice. Okay, before I go any further, we're going to start doing the swipe. I'm going to put... Um, the black. And this is a bigger canvas. I mean, it appears that way, so I need to see if how that one mm, might be a little bit wide. Scooby, Scooby Doo. I think I'm going to try this with. I'll show you the difference between the one I had just a second ago. See, it's a little bit smaller, not much. And then I've got other ones to choose from, so we're good. Um, got my paper towels to, to clean my swipe off with. All right, here is my um, cell activator. Golden's Oxide Black. And it's very, very thin compared to the other ones, okay? All right, I'll put that over there. And I love using my little spreader, and I just put it on right here. All right. Now, remember, I learned a lesson last time to um, make sure that I put it on um, with a light hand, not to press down, and just to gloss over. So basically, that's what I'm fixing to do. And in Texas, that means you're fixing to do something. Okay. Oh, I had two little cards here attached. All right. And then I'm going to do the wreck. Okay. Drizzle, swipe, wreck, and spin. 
All right. Let me, oh, went the wrong way. I kind of want you to be able to see. It's a little bit bigger, so I'm going to go out a little bit further. Sometimes it just takes like the first try or two to kind of. And um, remember, stop. When you see that you're running out of your cell enhancer, just stop. And um, anyhow, I'm going to start in the middle, like right here. Lay down and just bring it all the way down. That turn. Oh, look at those colors, right? And y'all, these little places right here, I'll come back with a thinner piece and we'll do it from there. This one's kind of wonky warped. I'm going to get a different one. I don't like that one. It didn't lay flat like I needed it to. Alright, All right, here we go with another one. See, I'm just putting it on there like that. Make sure I don't have too much on. Because you'll get these blobs, but I've kind of remedied my blobs, I think, with doing that. And I'm laying it flat. Oh, see? Somehow I lifted it up, but that's okay. I'm not going to worry about it. I'm not going to worry about it. I can come back with that. I'm thinking maybe these cards are a little bit different than the ones I used earlier today. Um, here we go. But... Oh, pretty, pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. Okay. I'll try this card on the other side now. I like this oxide black so much better than the Mars. Anybody else notice the Mars? And Kathleen never mentioned it when she said these are the colors that I use, you know. So I'm thinking maybe she found out or maybe that's what she had. I don't know, too. All right. I'm not going to push it down. I can come back and mess with that later. Okay. Get one more swipe and I'll change my card. Ah. I'm going to change it now. Wipe that back on. Changed my card. There's just something about that. The yellows. I don't know. I love yellow. For some reason, they're not catching the sides, but what they are doing is beautiful. Okay, y'all. I'm going to move to the next size down. See? There we go. Ooh, that's a pretty color. What's that? It's called Boathouse. Oh, pretty. Boathouse blue. Do -do, do -do 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 -do. Okay. I'll do it over here. All right. And I still have some on that side, so I'm going to get this side with it. Oh, shoot. That's what I did. I didn't even do it. Oh, well. <laughs> When in doubt, try again. Did I get it on the edge? Maybe that's my problem. There we go. Oh my gosh, really? Change that card out. I'm getting aggravated. Aggravated! <laughs> <laughs> While my grandson was here, we played aggravation, and his goal was to aggravate Mammy. And he did at times. He won. Oh. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to just gently, gently, let's see, a skinny one. There's nothing going to be on that skinny, but I'm going to try to move it just a see what it does. It made a mess. Okay, well, life goes on. Let's try, and I'm going to come back to these areas. Let's get this other side. Well, you can see that I kind of went, <laughs> and I forget some of these areas are under tape, so, but not that. That's 
pretty. So, today's a beautiful Thursday. Grandson made it to his destination yesterday. We had to go to the airport in Nashville. Oh, my thingy moved, but that's okay. And I miss him already. It's like just not fair that they live so far away. Mammy misses him awful. I was there when he was born. He's my first grandson. And I have three beautiful grandsons. I don't love one more than the other. But he's just my first. And because he's my first, my heart, you know. Hmm. I don't know what it is with those cards today. I'm not exactly happy with them. Certain brands, I guess it's the brand. I don't know. Here, we'll try another. I really don't think it matters with the um, the uh, cell activator or how what your blocks are. Okay. But that one worked nicer and it held its shape, so maybe it is. Let's see what card. This is Color Place. This is the Walmart card. I hate it that some of these are just going to be pulled off because I'm trying a tape method to go along with it, all right? Okay. Well, I'll be doggone. Look what I did there. I missed it completely. Well, use what you guys like. I'm finding I'm not happy necessarily. He wins all of this. Maybe I need more cell activator too. Where are you? Just a little because I'm almost done, right? Okay. Put a little bit on there. Make sure I cover all the way up. colors are absolutely, I'm glad I added that darker blue. I am glad that I did that. I'm going to go right there with this. Although that's under the tape, but just in case there's an edge that's not quite, then I can practice my swipe. <laughs> it does take a touch. There is a touch to it, I'm finding. Let's try that. Da, 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 da. And see this right here in the middle? I'm going to see if I can just gently do something there. And I think I muffled it up. What do they call it? What is Jilly? She says, I think I stuffed it. Jilly Cube, I absolutely adore her. <laughs> she is so hilarious, right? All right. I've learned many a thing from Jilly Cube, and one of the biggest ones is, is don't take yourself too seriously. Because you end up, you know, stuffing it up anyhow, or doing a great one, or one that's not so great, and whatever, right? Okay, well, because I know that some of these edges here, I'm not going to work, I know they're under the tape, so I'm not going to work on them too hard. Now, this area right here, I don't want to stuff it up. could add more color and redo it. I have done that before. 
I'm trying to see if I can do it with another way. Everybody likes to do it their way, right? I'll bring you in for some of these color, oh, blending, oh. because that's a definite, but I'm going to use what I have and just I mean it, it is bringing up something so but I don't want to mess up some of the beautiful things that I have there okay so the next part is da 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 my wreck but before I do that I'm going to take my leftover of this and I'm going to put it back in my bowl here because paint's expensive and this is golden <laughs> so there we go let me put my lid on it da, de -da, de -da. wipe my sides because it messes up the closure I wish I was good at that all the time but I'm not all right where's my lid oh, there's my lid okay I'm closing up my black just to get it out of the way all right guys not forgetting I need to wreck it now now is the wreck it time now remember I only have what to call it <clears throat> I might. I'm gonna leave it just like it is it is gorgeous email but I am going to do this wait a minute I know I'm saying wait a minute because y'all See that right? I know. This is not going to be covered, but I don't know what it is. I think it's a visual thing. Okay. So now it's time to wreck. Just have my little skewer that I kind of butt at the end off. And um, anyhow. Oh my gosh, look at this. This one looks like it's kind of doing a fractal where it has the little lacy fingers that go out from it. So let's see what happens. Um, that's wild and woolly. I don't know if I'm, maybe I want to do something maybe right in here. Remember, there's tape, tape about that far in. And right here is going to be mostly tape. Oh, I love that. I might have to add. Some of that right there, see it? I know, I start to whisper because it looks so pretty. I'll bring you in before I spin it. Da, 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 da. Where's my paper? Let me bring it in. Oh, out. And let me get, mm, see them, look at them. Oh, look at those colors, like, oh my gosh, right? Okay, well, I'm going to bring it out while I spin. If the movement bothers you, of course, the movement that I'm doing right there, if it bothers you, then close your eyes, turn your head, whatever. Okay, here we go. I've also learned not to overspin because you break up your cells. So guys, keep that in mind. Um, and I will show you the dried result before I post this because I want to let you see it. Okay. Oh gosh, I well it doesn't matter. I touched the side. Oh man, look how beautiful. It is, it's like stained glass, y'all. It's like stained glass. Okay, you see this area right here? I'm just gonna do another little something. Okay. And I'm gonna go the other direction. 
should have used my left hand and lefty. I'm ambidextrous. And I'm glad this is kind of going off because it looks like it's kind of done some type of weirdness. But anyhow, it is gorgeous. I'm going to bring you in for a close-up. after I pick it up. I do have it taped just on these ends underneath. I've got all of it taped underneath and I also have it taped in a frame form. Okay and hopefully I did it right because this is like a most beautiful, beautiful. to show you up close. All right, look at that stained glass gorgeousness. And I framed it because of the effect. And over here by this, you see that? I think that might be that I did a little bit too much spinning at that point, and there, it was just the way it is. Um, see my tape? I just had it on those two edges. Let's set this down for a sec. Um, and get a napkin or a paper towel, paper towels actually, my puppy paper towels that we had to get. And remember there's areas that if I don't like them I can take the color that I'm not real happy with and I've been doing little improvisate, imp improvs. Now this is taped but this is not. But see that? I wanted to, it's kind of broken right there. It's the only place on here I don't want to do too much. Okay, and the longer it sits, the more it does something. Um, like it's still reacting. It's still doing its pretty. So this is a little piece I'm not real sure. Remember to bring right up. Don't bring it, just make sure it's finished dripping and then move it. Okay, gently move it. Um, I'm going to do something right in here. I bring that through. That was an area of the black that I wasn't real fond of. And the white coming through does help those areas in black. <laughs> And when this is drying, because I've done this before, I'll show you a technique I've done before. Make sure my, I have no paint on me, because it is like on my wall. It's ready. And I'll show you what the taped view looked like. And I actually did a, like a, uh, oh, what do they call it? A Dutch pour, but I used my, um, airbrush. Anyhow. And that's how it turned out. And I let it flow over and I had it taped. I had it taped here and around this side. And then only the little bit on this side, on this canvas, did it show the overflow, which I loved. Um, but anyhow, that's how that one turned out. And yes, this is for sale too. It's a 12 by 12. It is gallery wrap, but it's the um uh just it's not as deep but it is gallery wrapped still good quality okay so um, anyhow it is gorgeous 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 okay anyhow but that's what we're working on right now so hang on let me put this back so I don't get anything on it so my goal is to have a beautiful framed look when we're done all of this is gonna be gone which I'm glad about that and this little blah right there. So all of that's going to be gone. All of the side is going to be gone. So that area that I kind of touched on the side, well, no worries because it's gone. Um, but yes, it's gorgeous. This is absolutely gorgeous. Look at that. Okay, y'all. I am done. I am so thankful, again, that you shared this time with me. Thank you to all my subscribers and all the kind words. If you like this, go ahead and hit the thumbs up. Hello, hello. Tell your friends about me and share it. You're welcome to share this. Um, 
and go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already y'all it's free and it's and it's free relaxation free time to enjoy another's company you know a lot of people are out there and they're alone but come and join me okay hopefully today y'all will spark a little bit of happy in somebody's heart that's my plan for each day um, anyhow y'all thank you very much anyhow I'll see you next time okay here on happy art creations toodaloo I'm so glad you came goodbye goodbye now toodaloo goodbye now bye bye goodbye now